Uh, we're a very international community, um, with most students not being Dutch. Everyone knows each other, and there's no pressure of fitting into a model. Whatever you have, whatever you want to be, you can just do it. In Project Science Learning, you work in a small group of six students, so you have to work with lots of different people, uh, all from different countries and social backgrounds. All my teachers I know by first name. They're very approachable, and once you ask for them to help you, they are straight on to do it. I don't know all the programs, but I think a lot of them are focused on artificial intelligence or only on data science, and we do a mix of both which means that at the end of the day, you have a broader background. And on top of this, we're the only studies that offers the research track or the projects or key at work. Knowledge engineering at work is an honors path where basically two days a week you work at a company instead of doing projects. So what I do right now is I conduct analysis on the Dutch population on social media. In the research path, you look at a research question, and this year they're doing using drones to find uh, survivors after things like earthquakes. While working at a company gives you real experience, the business side of it, and it's good on your CV. You just it's easier to get a job. I get a lot of job offers through that path, which is really good. There's so much to do in master. There's a lot of bars and cafes. So our study association, uh, Incognito, is really active. So every beginning of the block, we have a block opening drink. And that's where I learned to know a lot of my friends there. We have an academic committee too. It's not all about fun, it's also about education. DK is one of the biggest mix of people. Uh, you have a lot of sporty people, a lot of film lovers, a lot of gamers. It's not one type of student. Um, and this is quite unique for this kind of study. So I went to the open days. I fell in love with the city and the history of it. And then I just couldn't leave anymore. <laughs> <laughs>